Drones are one of the greatest innovations in aviation technology. These unmanned remote-controlled aircrafts have a myriad of uses and a hefty price tag. Not anymore, it seems. Arnold Bett, a student at the University of Nairobi, has managed to build his very own drone with the help of locally sourced components and 3D printing. Uh, buying a ready commercial uh, drone is very expensive. Um, that will mostly range between $5,000 to $6,000. Uh, and, and for us, building one, the most probably it will cost us is about uh, $1,000, but on average $500 to $1,000. Dubbed Octocopter, the drone has already been put to work researching potato farms in neighboring Tanzania. This innovation in data collection is being hailed as groundbreaking by agricultural researchers. Instead of analyzing one crop at a time uh, in a large field or in a large area, even in a, in a small area, it can be very challenging going crop by crop and uh, remote sensing uh, allows you to capture the whole field in one image or a mosaic of several images and analyze it at once. The legal framework for drones in Africa is still in its infancy. Bet is not authorized to fly his drone in Kenya, even though he was able to use it in Tanzania. Nonetheless, he has still managed to catch the eye of a few tech enthusiasts. The drone. I've only seen the drone in movies. I never I never thought I could see it in real life, but today I saw it. Very fascinated by the drone uh, and its applicability, especially in this um, part of the world, um, in agriculture. Bet hopes the attention he is receiving for his innovation will push for faster, more flexible legislation for public and commercial use of unmanned aerial vehicles. Catherine Omwando, CCTV.